Hi everyone, on Grow Big TV tonight, our live starts at 7 o'clock. I know I told you guys 8, but tonight we are starting at 7. And then going forward, it's going to be at 8. So the interview today is with John Rulak. Now John, he was a founder of Nutiva. He has soared and formulated $1 billion in retail sales of organic superfoods. Boom. John is a serial entrepreneur, investor, writer, philanthropist, uh, an executive producer of the Netflix uh, blockbuster, Regener Regenerative Agriculture, the film Kiss the Crown. I'm going to show you guys that in a couple of seconds. Uh, he also, he's also founded uh, six nonprofit organizations, including the Great Plains Re uh, Regeneration Agro forestry, regeneration communities, and forests forever. We have an awesome guest. There's so much to learn from John. Um, and so I want to show everybody the film, Kiss the Ground. You're going to like this. We can ask questions about it too. So here is Kiss the Ground. There's so much bad news about our planet. It's so overwhelming. truth is, I've given up. This is the story of a simple solution, a way to heal our planet. The solution is right under our feet, and it's as old as dirt. All of our soils that are under chemical conventional agriculture are almost completely devoid of microorganisms. Modern agriculture was not designed for the betterment of the soil. Fossil fuels are by no means the only thing that is causing climate change. When we damage soils, carbon goes back to the atmosphere. But when we destroy soil, it releases carbon dioxide. Biosequestration is using plants, trees, and techniques of grazing and farming to capture carbon and store it in the soil. We can fix a lot of our climate issues to we bring the CO2 down into a living plant and put it back into the soil where it belongs. Plants working with soil microorganisms, it seems too simple. Healthy soils lead to a healthy plant, healthy plant, healthy human, healthy climate. There could be a way to eat food that heals the planet. The problem isn't the animal. The problem is where the animals are at. How do we take waste and repurpose and reuse it because it's really not waste? The poop has to stay in the loop. Compost is just one of a suite of soil-based carbon capture solutions. We know how to do it. And if we continue to scale over 30 years, we can reverse global warming. We can get the earth back to the Garden of Eden that it once was by regeneration. To see biodiversity return to a place that was completely devastated, that gives me hope. Our health and the health of our planet are connected. If you look over here, my neighbor's land that has been chemical fallow, then you look over at our paddocks, you have a diversity of different plant species. Which model do you want your food to be produced from? The answer is pretty simple to me. I'll make you a deal. I won't give up, and neither should you. Kiss the ground. So I think that's really awesome. And you hear it in the background. Yeah, that's Woody Harrison. Pretty awesome, right? So I'll see everybody at 7 o'clock tonight. Great interview lined up. Share it out, please. And uh, see you guys soon. Take care. Boom.